Absolutely, Charlie. It was good to see you a few weeks ago at your home. You are Likewise. you are Likewise, looking you, you are looking great and you're completely clean, aren't you? Hundred percent. You know, here's your first P test. Next one goes in your mouth. No, you won't get high. It's all good. It's all good, guys. Quit panicking. Quit panicking. No panic, no judgment. And you're working out even a couple times a day sometimes. Um, well, yeah, but there's only one time in the gym if you catch my drift, Alex. Uh, <laughs> oh. Whatever. We're not live, are we? No, we're live. Uh, Charlie, uh, speaking of that, the media, uh, if you don't want to go there, you don't want to ever defend yourself, but you've told me privately most of the stuff, most of the names, it's, it's, it, it's not true. But what is going on uh, with the women in your life? The goddesses. Alex, the goddesses. Um, let me just say this about the goddesses. I don't believe the term is... Uh, is good enough. Is good enough. Um, but when you're bound by these uh, these, these these terrestrial uh, descriptions, you must use the best choice available, right? Yes. So if you think about it, dude, it's like I'm over three with marriage, uh, with never an excuse. But but like in baseball, the scoreboard doesn't lie. Never has. So what what we all have um, is a is a marriage of the heart of the hearts. Uh, and I, you know, to, to, to sully, to contaminate or, you know, uh, or radically uh, disrespect this union with a shameful contract is something I will, yeah, you know, leave to the amateurs and the Bible grippers. The Bible grippers. And then I just got to add this. There was a whole firestorm yesterday about, about Brooke being, uh, you know, a part of our, a part of our crew. And this, let me just say this, this is all I'm going to say about it was, is that, uh, where there were four, um, there are now three. But bye, Brooke, and uh, good luck in your travels. You're going to need it badly. So, so Brooke did go along with you, but she's not there now. No, she's not there now, and 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 we are, and I don't know, winning anyone. Rhymes with winning, anyone? Yeah, that would be us. <laughs> Sorry, man, didn't make the rules. Oops. Well, well, Charlie, I've known you for six, six and a half years or so, and I knew you when you were completely clean, uh, and then I've known you since, but, but the point is now, I've never seen you, when I was out at your house and talked to you on the phone, so energized as you are now. I mean, you, uh, I mean you're on fire, uh, as Nails uh, told the news yesterday. I mean, I agree with that description. Well, I think it was Nails that said, and I was really, really flattered because he got it right that I'm not, you know, he might be Nails, but I'm freaking bayonets, you know. <laughs> I am battle-tested bayonets, bro, and I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm tired. I'm so tired of pretending like my life isn't perfect and bitching and just winning every second, and I'm not perfect and bitching and just delivering the goods at every freaking turn because look what I'm dealing with, man. I'm dealing with fools and trolls, you know, I'm dealing with, with soft targets, and it's just... You know, it's it's just strafing runs in my underwear before my first cup of coffee because I don't have time for these clowns. I don't have time for their judgment and their stupidity. And, you know, they lay down with their ugly wives in front of their ugly children and just look at their loser lives. And then they look at me and they say, I can't process it. Well, no, and you never will. Stop trying. Just sit back and enjoy the show. You know? Wow. I am uh, I am speechless.